Welcome to Amazing Life One Channel Guides Today you watching Lucy Hale. American Actress. Lifestyle Biography and Beautiful Photos I hope you enjoy this video like share subscribe channel thank you for watching video your favorite actress model singer celebrity biography photos images if you want to see please comment. Starting. Nickname Lucy Hale Gender Female Age 33 Years Old In 2023, Date of Birth June 14, 1989 Real Name Karen Lucille Hale Profession Actress Nationality American Birthplace Memphis, Tennessee United States Religion Christianity Zodiac Sign Gemini Father Name Preston Hale Mother Name Julie Knight Brother Name N. Assister Name Maggie Hale Height, Weight and Physical Stats Body measurements 3 4, 2 4, 3 3 inches body type slim height 5 feet 2 inches 1.70 meters weight 51 kilograms 112 pounds waist 24 inches hair color dark brown eye color green shoe size 6 US dress size 6 US biography Karen Lucille Hale born June 14, 1989 is an American actress, singer, and television personality who first became known for her roles as Becca Summers in the series Bionic Woman 2007 and Rose Baker in the series Privilege 2008-2009. She then had her breakthrough starring as Arya Montgomery in the freeform series Pretty Little Liars 2010-2017 for which she received several accolades. She starred as Stella Abbott in Life Sentence 2018 and the titular character in Katie Keene 2020. She has appeared in films such as The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants 2, 2008, Sorority Wars, 2009, A Cinderella Story, Once Upon a Song and Scream 4, both 2011, and led the films Truth or Dare and Dude, both 2018, and Fantasy Island, 2020. In addition to acting, Hale has also ventured into music. In 2003, she first came to prominence as one of the five winners of the reality show American Juniors, a children's spin-off of Fox's American Idol and began as a solo artist with signing Hollywood Records in 2012, on her debut studio album, Road Between, 2014. Early Life Hale was born in Memphis, Tennessee, to Julie Knight and Preston Hale. She was named after one of her great-grandmothers. Her mother is a registered nurse. She has an older sister, Maggie, a stepsister, Kirby, and a stepbrother Wes. Hale was homeschooled as a child. During her childhood, she took acting and singing lessons. In August 2012, Hale revealed she had suffered from an eating disorder. Career 2003-2009, Early Roles In 2003, Hale first appeared on television as a contestant in the Fox reality show American Juniors. On July 30, 2003, Hale finished in fourth place and part of a group of the same name formed with the top five finishers Chauncey Matthews, Danielle White and Tori and Taylor Thompson, but the group disbanded in 2005, after their self-titled studio album's lackluster sales. Hale moved to Los Angeles at age 15 in the hopes of getting a record deal. Shortly after, she started auditioning and received a minor role on Drake and Josh and other guest roles on shows such as Ned's Declassified School Survival Guide, The O.C., and How I Met Your Mother. She appeared in two episodes of the Disney Channel show Wizards of Waverly Place in 2007, Hale appeared in NBC's short-lived series Bionic Woman. Hale plays Becca Summers, the younger sister of the title character Jamie Summers played by Michelle Ryan. The character was originally portrayed by Mae Whitman in the unaired pilot episode, after which Whitman departed the series. In August 2008, Hale made her big screen debut in The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants 2 portraying Effie Caligaris, the younger sister of Lena Caligaris played by Alexis Bledel. Hale then appeared in the CW series Privileged as Rose Baker, with co-stars Ashley Newbrow and Joanna Garcia. She starred in the Lifetime television film Sorority Wars. 2010-2012, Pretty Little Liars and Music. In October 2009, Hale was cast as Aria Montgomery in Pretty Little Liars, based on the book series of the same name by Sarah Shepard. The television series lasted seven seasons from 2010 to 2017, with Hale's performance being praised by critics. She also received a number of awards and nominations, including 17 Choice Awards, a Gracie Allen Award, a People's Choice Award and a Young Hollywood Award. In January 2010, Hale appeared as the singer Phoebe Nichols and her identical body double Vanessa Patton in the CSI, Miami episode, Show Stopper. In 2011, Hale had a cameo role as Sherry in the slasher film Scream 4. Later, 
she was cast as the aspiring singer Katie Gibbs in A Cinderella Story, Once Upon a Song, the third installment of A Cinderella Story series and was released on direct-to-video in September 2011. She recorded songs for the film's soundtrack. Throughout her career, Hale made appearances of music videos with artists, Foy Vances, She Burns, Chase Jordans, Lose Control, Take a Sip, and Jackson Harris's, Come Back Down to Earth. Hale hosted an episode of MTV's Punk aired on April 26, 2012, where she successfully pranked with Pretty Lit Liars co-star Ian Harding, Vanessa Hudgens and Josh Hutcherson. The same year, Hale played the voice of Periwinkle, a twin sister of Tinker Bell, voiced by Mae Whitman in the animated Disney film Secret of the Wings. In June 2012, Hale announced that she had signed a record deal with Hollywood Records co-partnership with DMG Nashville. 2013 Present Films and current work. On June 11, 2013, Hale announced that she is the new ambassador of the beauty brand Mark Girl. Hale was co hosted for the television event shows, the Teen Choice Awards with Darren Chris in 2013 and David Dobrik in 2019, and the 2014 MTV Video Music Awards pre show with Sway Calloway. On February 18, 2014, Hale's debut studio album was announced to be called Road Between, released on June 3, 2014. In 2015, Hale collaborated with Rascal Flatts, performed a cover of Let It Go from another Disney animated film Frozen and was featured on the compilation album We Love Disney. Later, Hale served as a correspondent in New Orleans and co-hosted with Ryan Seacrest in Times Square for Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve 2016 present making her the first millennial actress to co-host the Times Square segments. Hale recorded two songs, Mistletoe, and, You're Here, on the Christmas album A Hollywood Christmas, released on December 8, 2017. Hale recorded two songs, Mistletoe, and, You're Here, on the Christmas album A Hollywood Christmas, released on December 8, 2017. In 2018, Hale was cast in the CW comedy drama series Life Sentence as Stella Abbott, a woman who finds out that her terminal cancer is cured. The series which only lasted one season. The same year, Hale starred in three films, Truth or Dare, Dude and the Unicorn. On March 11, 2019, Hale was cast as the lead role in Katie Keene, based on the Archie Comics character of the same name. In 2020, Hale starred as Melanie Cole in the supernatural horror film Fantasy Island. Hale is set to appear in the upcoming projects such as the films Borrego and The Hating Game, with Austin Stoll. In 2021, Hale became a brand ambassador and model for lingerie company Hunkemaller. Artistry Hale described music as her first love. Her early musical influences were Shania Twain and Faith Hill, but what ignited her interest in pursuing music was Britney Spears. Baby One More Time, Christian Bush of country band Sugarland said, She sounds like Carrie Underwood, strong with a blues side and a pop side to it. And a lot like Faith Hill. Lucy Hale Boyfriend relationship and dating. Lucy Hale has been very private about her personal life, but she has had a few notable relationships in the past. In 2007, Lucy began dating musician David Henry, but they broke up after a few months. She then went on to date actor Chris Zilka in 2012, but their relationship was short-lived. From 2013 to 2014, Lucy was in a relationship with musician Joel Krauss. They were together for almost a year before calling it quits. In 2018, Lucy was rumored to be dating actor Ryan Rotman, but there was no official confirmation from either party. Currently, Lucy is reportedly single and focused on her career. She has stated in interviews that she prefers to keep her personal life private and out of the public eye. Despite her desire for privacy, Lucy's fans have remained curious about her relationships and dating life. However, Lucy has made it clear that she values her privacy and wants to keep her personal life separate from her professional life.